Okay, so question 21 is a typical circle theorems question. We're told that B, C and D are points on the circumference of a circle, so uh, as shown, and A, B, E and A, D, F are tangents to the circle. Now, I'm going to, I'm going to, this information is really important for getting at least one mark here. Um, D, A, B is 40, C, B, E is 75, work out the angle O, D, C. Right. If you see the word tangent to a circle, and it's a circle theorems question, and you can see there's a tangent to the circle uh, with the radius, first thing you should always do, draw in a right angle. Okay, you will get yourself one mark just for marking it on the diagram, um, the right angle there. Um, now, let's see what we can fill in. We're asked for the angle ODC, which is going to be ODC, so it's got to be this angle in here. Right. Let's see what we can figure out. That's 40 degrees there. That's 90. That's 90. And we have an angle here. Now let's see if we can get this angle here. Well, D A B O forms a quadrilateral. It's a four sided shape here. And all quadrilaterals have 360 degrees in them. So if that's 90, and that's 90, and that's 40, that's 220 degrees. So that means the angle here must be 360 degrees minus that 220 degrees. So that's from 40 plus 90 plus 90. Now that's going to give us 140 degrees. So I know that this is now 140 degrees. I now also know this angle here. And that's because the angle at the center is twice the angle at the circumference. So if you see this type of arrowhead shape, and you know that that's 140, this angle here has got to be 70. It's going to be half that angle at the center. I also know other pieces of information, so let's get them filled in. Um, if that's a 90 degree angle, well then the other side completely must be a 90 degree angle. And if that's 75, it means that this angle here has got to be 15 degrees okay and similarly if that's 140 degrees there I now know the other side the the, uh, the reflex angle so over here this red angle that I've just marked in must be 220 degrees also now the last part let's see if we can figure out what our angle at D is here C D O okay now, I'm going to highlight these four letters here, and hopefully you can see that actually we've got another quadrilateral, okay? We've got a four-sided shape here, means 360 degrees. Well, we know that that's 70, so we've got 70, we've got 220 here, and we've got 15 here. And when we add them up, we're going to get 305. So, three of the angles make up 305 degrees, which means that last angle that we're looking for is got to be 360 minus 305, which gives us an answer of 55 degrees.